chest pains. I would try to go for walks and when I was working out or just random chest pains, I would get random chest pains. So January 2021, I had this surgery to get rid of the polyps, which could have been cancerous, precancerous. At the time, I, 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 knew, I knew nothing about this stuff. So after the surgery, the pathology came back and my OBGYN was surprised that it came back cancerous or precancerous. Um, and that was alarming. So she, she told me she got everything out. So at this stage, it was just to monitor and watch to see what was gonna happen. Um, exercise and we would monitor it in six months because the only other thing would be hormone treatment through birth control to balance out my hormones to prevent any kind of cancer. So I went about, you know, my life with her recommendation about getting healthier, eating right, losing weight, started to do all of that because I was being bad with my diet and eating stuff I know I shouldn't eat like a lot of sweets at night and not exercising right so I started to exercise I cut out a lot of the sugary stuff that I was eating I fasted for the whole month of March every Wednesday I would not eat for 12 hours um, during the day and um, I was not eating anything bad during that time. I try to switch, start switching to vegan um, through March and April and started exercising a lot. And starting in April, my sister told me about Chloe Ting. If you guys haven't heard of Chloe Ting, she's, she's, she'll get you right. So I was working on that. Um, and I noticed that I wasn't losing weight. And in, in actuality, I was very bloated. Um, and I've never felt this way before. So I didn't know what to think. I just thought it was like me getting older. Um, the exercises I was doing wasn't working. And the bloating in my stomach, and I'll show some pictures of that. It was just like getting really bad after going through April and again I was getting irregular periods after April going into May and in May um, and I forgot to mention that I my legs were swelling up at, like here and there and chest pains I would try to go for walks and when I was working out or just random chest pains I would get random chest pains so I just started noticing these symptoms and just noting them. After two weeks of my period in May, I reached out again to my OBGYN like, listen, I'm having irregular periods again. Is this something I should be concerned about? Um, at that point, I had already made an annual appointment to do just a normal checkup and they told me to just keep logging my cycle and we'll discuss it in the next um, appointment which by that time was in the beginning of June God is good all the time and he will continue to give me the strength to get through all of this but 